It's cheddar. And it's from a cave. We're visiting the home of cheddar cheese. But why do they make cheddar cheese in caves? And why does it look like this? <laughs> oh, come on, cheer up. Not every cheddar gets the English cheese quality. English cheddar, only the best is up to the mark. Mmm, a little cheddar makes plain veggies taste better. Oh, I'm a bit cheese dog. If you like cheese, you love them. Cheddar cheese, it turns tortilla chips into hot, delicious nachos. But take away the cheddar. Hey, cheddar cheddar. 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 With real cheddar cheese. We're here in Cheddar, which is in the southern county of Somerset. There are lots and lots of lots of cheese shops around, and they sell many different types of cheddar. You can even make your own cheese. The scenery is very beautiful. There's lots of different places to explore, but most people are here for buying lots of cheese. On the way to the caves, we even saw King Arthur's sword. This is Cheddar Gorge, and it's probably the biggest canyon in the UK. But we're here to find the cheesy treasures inside the cave. But first, we need to feed Fluffy. Now we're going to Goff's cave, which is the largest cave in Cheddar. And I'm sure we'll find some cheese inside. This is the original cheddar-made cheddar cheese. 
It didn't smell that strong, even though it looks moldy like this. They use the cave because it's very wet and humid, which adds lots of flavor to the cheese, although it doesn't look very nice with the mold on there. Anyways, time to get out of this creepy cave. It was very cold, very cheesy, very smelly, and slippery. 